Hello, I'm Annie Shi. The topic of the workshop today is maximizing your work placement opportunities from preparation to completion. Since we're English majors, our career is not just limited to a particular sector because many jobs require effective communication. In my following presentation, I'm going to share with you my work experience. I will focus on how to make good use of our time at university to look for our interests and the attitude you need to have while looking for jobs. These are what I did in the past three years. I do not have much special work experience, but I would like to give you a message that the time when we are studying at the university is the best time to find out what we are interested in. So I strongly encourage you to try different new things. I was a summer student in a law firm, a tutor in a secondary school, a shop assistant in Australia, and a student assistant at Poly U. I will tell you the stories one by one. Here comes the first one, a summer student in a law firm. I used to think that I want to be a lawyer because I'm quite disciplined and I like sticking to rules. Luckily, a few years ago, I was given a chance to work in a law firm. I was responsible for some basic clerical work, such as writing drafts, scanning, telephoning, and receiving clients. It is actually my first job in my life. I didn't even know how to fax a document at that time. After the work, I learned a lot about the office work and the operation of a law firm. I could also read some legal documents and learned about some ordinance related to conveyancing and property. Well, but that's not the thing I really like. I don't find reading the laws interesting, so I know that I would not be a lawyer in the future. Later, a teacher from my alma mater asked me to be a tutor in the summer bridging class. I accepted, although I had to rush to the school after a lecture at Poly U. In the class, I helped some former students to get used to the English atmosphere by teaching them some common English vocabulary used in different subjects. I also helped some weaker students with their English in the supplementary classes. This is the feedback from my students. I was glad that I could share my knowledge with them and see them improve. After having some teaching experience. I took the service learning subject this year, teaching some primary students in a community center in Yamate. I really enjoyed teaching, and I think I will regard teaching as my future career. Two years ago, I joined the overseas WIE program and worked in Australia. I remember that I chose teaching, but it turned out I was assigned to a sports store. That wasn't that bad because I loved to try something new. Therefore, when I was off duty, I checked those words I didn't know and memorized them. But then, I had another problem: I didn't have any professional knowledge to give suggestions to the customers, like which brand of the sportswear is better. I was lucky because my boss was willing to help me with patience. While、well, working as a shop assistant wasn't an easy job, this is my boss. He and I were the only workers there. As you can see, the shop is really huge, selling new and second-hand machines, clothes, trainers, balls, and other sportswear. At work, I encountered some difficulties. The first thing was that I didn't know all the names of the goods there, so how could I sell them? What I want to say is that sometimes there are things that you may not like to do, but at least you should try them. Don't let every opportunity slip. When you encounter any difficulties, try to find ways to overcome them. Finally, the working experience I'd like to share with you is that I work here at Poly U as a student assistant. I help some professors with their research projects, such as those on multimodality and discourse analysis. If you'd like to do research or pursue a higher degree, it is important that you get some research experience. Some teachers often send us emails looking for student helpers. If you are interested, you can try them, and you can also learn a lot. Before I end my presentation, I'd like to share my career plan. When I graduate this year, I'm going to do an MA in linguistics at UCL. I hope to get a PhD and teach at a university in the future.